Hi Sagittarius, how are you guys doing? Let's dive into your reading. Let's see what's coming up for you this week in love, Sagittarius. Of course, reverse the rules if needed, switch the cases, but do not try to impose the reading on your situation, right? Sagittarius. I feel good. I feel a good smell. Are you guys using some kind of perfume? Hmm. Okay. Four of Cups. Okay. It's boring. You need some excitement, Satch. You need some excitement. Things are turning a little boring for you, I see. There was a Cancer Pisces Scorpio in your surroundings. You might be dealing with one. You might be feeling love for somebody. And I see li right now that emotional situation is in some kind of limbo. There's a lot of confusion and uh, you, you might be feeling the options right now or it's simply confusion. There's cloudiness. You don't know what decision to make. And then the wheel turns in. This is very positive. Okay. So overall it appears good. All I see, a challenge can be some Cancer by Scorpio or someone important, right? And your situation appears to be a little confusing right now. And because of that confusion, I see you are not accepting any cups. Turning somebody down, not feeling happy about something, little dissatisfied, feel like turning some opportunity down. Okay. What's the situation about? Let's see. Ooh, King of Swords, Six of Cups, and the Fool. I see you're a little agitated about something that happened in the past, and you want to start afresh. Walking the way energy can be somebody who walked away from you, or somebody who blocked something out, and that's why you walked away from this person. Someone was resisting something. I see King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy can be dealing with one, but overall I see somebody quite agitated little angry trying to make some logical decisions keeping the heart at the back seat this is something surrounding a past situation and i see that you are a little angry about some past situation for some of you this can be an anger related to a past decision or a leap of faith you took towards somebody on the other way around i see you agitated about some past situation and you're willing to take some leap of faith in some other direction so both ways i see some past situation is returning on your mind or maybe in the physical realm and that's a little agitating for you or somebody you're dealing with and that's why i see some leap of faith is being called for or you're feeling like taking the leap of faith towards something else here okay the moon the hermit oh okay ace of swords for some of you i see the clarity was missing Saj. the clarity was missing and that's why this was causing some disappointment this is surrounding some love situation i see water sign and air sign energy so it can be two important signs in your surroundings overall i see uh, piscean energy cancerian energy virgo there is love i see aries and sad energy here so what i see from the cards here sad is that the moon shows me that you're not very happy with someone's words or someone's behavior someone is acting cold and i see you miss something about this person but they're very cold and this is causing anger on your mind as well things are heating up right you can call it as a bit of a situation where um i see disappointment because of someone's words and hermit shows me that you need some time off this might be your realization that it's becoming too much right it's becoming too much this is feeling dissatisfied feeling like turning away from something and moon shows me that you're not very happy with that situation for some of you i see there are some deep-seated secrets which you don't want to share with anybody and you feel like as if nobody's going to understand even if i say that there is kind of feeling that some kind of secrets some kind of uh, hidden things are there behind the scenes and you're feeling very disappointed about it but i see in the near future just the next thing within a day or two some clarity is coming in and this clarity is going to push you towards a sharp new sharp new beginning in your life ending came out of my mouth i don't know why so can be just releasing something and moving on in your life i see you cutting out something now and this clarity this truth is going to help you take some leap of faith in your life 
so this is going to be something major because i see two major arcanas here and this is happening with you after a major phase major is hermit so yeah there is something which is upon something you're pondering about in your mind right now i feel you might be feeling like being isolated and not really talking to much people in your surroundings but i see eventually some truth clarity information or some messages coming in and this is going to force you somehow to make a bold decision and this is going to be a harsh one right this might be coming towards you or simply you are doing that but i see something getting released and a new beginning taking place after detaching yourself from something right so uh, one thing that I heard here is that, that don't try to make any decision out of uh, disappointment or you know just because the, right now there are some em negative emotions going on on your mind. Do not let those negative emotions dominate on your mind because sometimes what happens is that when these negative emotions dominate we tend to make decisions out of a compulsion. You know, th those negative emotions force us to make some decisions which we might not really be very satisfied with in future. So, be careful with that. Let's dive in a little deeper. Let's see what's coming up next for you. Advices, future advices or something that is coming towards you in the near future. Okay, four of pentacles. It's time to a little hold back. Just step back a little i see knight of pentacles and page of swords interesting two of wands so i see someone coming towards you sat in the near future and this person is leveling up to make a decision for some of you i see uh, you very soon you're going to hear some news some information about this person and they want to tell you that they've made a decision this can be the same person who walked away from you in past and uh, they left some situation behind for some of you there was an offer to um, start afresh in a situation i see you were taking a leap of faith to start afresh and probably it was not going well with this person before that beginning before that decision things were going well and you were happy and satisfied and this person was also feeling happy that things are about to change but ace of pentacles shows me that the moment that shift happened the change happened someone felt like walking a bit away because this person felt that there's no point in investing here anymore i see you're going to hear from this person very soon and they're going to tell you about what decision they have made about something or if you're waiting on to some decision i think the decision is coming in or in general if you're not waiting on to something this person is coming in to share what they have decided so i see you might hear from somebody very soon but in the near future, I see you don't really bother about what decisions have been made because I see you turning somebody down or you just not liking the decision being offered to you. I see you not opening up in the near future and in the near future, the advice is also coming up, up here, Satch, that do not force yourself into any decision. If you don't trust a situation, if, if your heart says that there's something wrong and I need to step back from my personal healing and growth, do that if you feel like releasing something and not working over a project or a situation in your life do that because i see something new waiting for you an opportunity which can promise you something long term something stable something that you deserve something which is going to stay with you for quite a while i see this situation is more promising at least it appears that way and because it's appearing that way you're being advised to get more information about it you're being advised to know more details whatever new situation or proposal that is coming towards you you're being advised to just uh, look for more information look for something uh, which can uh, confirm the i don't know i heard uh, authenticity i heard that word you need to confirm the authenticity of something because what's coming towards you is slow steady grounded and has a promising future so you are being advised to get more information and track about it page of swords is a little spine card also for me so when it comes up as the advice i always feel that someone needs to do a little spy work search the facebook Inst instagram or some kind of social media uh, get to know this person more sometimes you know we get clues i don't know why i'm talking like a detective right now but i guess i'm getting a message that you need to dig deeper in a situation and get more information about somebody or something or some project you're working over right 
So advice comes up as you need to stop investing into the situations where you feel drained. I definitely pick up that there's something which is draining you, something that your heart says is not right. So it is going to be there. It's going to be there very soon. You're walking in the darkness right now, but the clarity is coming in sad. So be where you are. Hold back if you feel like there's definitely something else waiting for you. But if your heart is saying that this is not the position, this is not the place where I have to invest, stop it straight away, right? We're going to see a card or two, Saj. Very interesting reading. What is this page of cups? What are you not liking? And what is being offered to you that you don't like? Beer. Okay, this can be an apology. I see some past apology is coming back which you don't really care about anymore. Or even if you care, uh, there is some corner which is telling you that don't accept it. This can be apology. This can be somebody who appears to be responsible. Somebody who um, has a kind of honest uh, uh, feeling for you. But I think you've outgrown something. There is no harm in working with this person. I see this person as harmless for now. I see they're bringing in something for you. But you don't really feel satisfied about what they're being off what is being offered to you. For some of you, I see that you and this person are uh, from different situations, right? And they're very emotional. I see water all, all over. This person is coming in and giving you something out of emotions. And you probably don't want emotions in this situation. So you need to see how it is. Ship. Can you see water here? Someone is trying to walk past some very turbulent emotional situation. Okay, Six of Cups to the Fool. I see the anger here. If you are a sad male, then I see you very agitated. And other way around, if you are a sad female, you might be dealing with an Aries Leo Sag. I'm sorry, Gemini Libra Aquarius. This person was a little cold in past. And then they took some stand or took some step which appeared to be a little foolish to you. It can be that way, right? What was this uh, past situation that forced you to take a leap of faith away from somebody? Or towards cross normally I see this as some religious situation some cultural factor I see that there was some difference there is no doubt emotion here but there is some factor which is telling you that you need to be free from something can be some kind of belief system that you need to let go of can be some kind of outlook you need to let go of cultural belief system this can be for some of you cross shows me sometimes ending also right but uh, i don't really take it that way i see that this is something of the past which probably went wrong because of some belief system a person was carrying and you were not very satisfied with that right so i see you took a leap of faith away from this person i see this person tried protecting some kind of past belief system or some, some kind of past situation and fish just shows me Piscean energy here. So moon. Okay. I see that you just felt like walking away from the situation for a moment because you felt that there are other fishes in the pond. What is this uh, hermit energy? I want to know. What is this hermit energy? What is making you feel dissatisfied in the situation? Hermit energy. The lady. Okay. There is a specific lady okay ship someone wants to travel to you or someone wants to travel away from you someone wants to travel in some way you're getting a letter from this person about the confusion being created in in their surroundings i see the letter as somebody trying to communicate to you overseas you might be hearing from somebody listen uh, living at a distant location from you maybe really far off different countries or different cities or something like that and uh, the letter shows me that this person has a message to share but for most of you i'm picking up that this person is under some other influences what they're saying here is under some other influences and they're following it like a child there are people there are people keeping an eye over them and they are being influenced by some maybe cultural beliefs maybe that's the point that is picking that is coming up here that someone is getting influenced by some kind of cultural beliefs and you're getting the clarity about this lady or you are the lady if you're dealing with this person you're getting some clarity about that situation but i see that there is a feminine energy involved in the picture and you might hear from a feminine energy this week 
uh, can be a lady calling you and telling you the whole scenario can be anybody in common but you're getting some information here about that and that's going to be a clear a clarity you need right i want to know what is this offer coming in because i see you turning you're shutting something down you're not opening up to something and that is what is needed here that is coming up as the advice also because meanwhile you deal with some situation bit of a situation that we picked up something new is entering here which you need to be uh, i don't really see skepticism oh wow can you see sun rider these two cards come out and lock it so it can be a proposal for some of you i see if you're dealing in an arranged marriage setting again this came to my mind because of some cultural value systems so if you're dealing in an, in in a situation where uh, there might be somebody with an orthodox outlook or somebody's forcing you to be in some kind of arranged setup i see that another proposal is also coming in this is specific to those dealing in that kind of situation I see sun with the rider, something coming in and that is about another proposal which is more satisfying. It's, it's, it's moving slowly and you're being advised to get more information about it. You're being advised to dig deeper. I do see that there is a positive ray of hope with the sun and it's, it's going to be in good light. But still some spy work is needed here, right? Locket shows me proposal, a love message, a confession. It might be coming towards you from overseas. So, wow, this is very interesting. Last but not the least, what messages Sagittarius needs to hear? What messages Sagittarius needs to hear in this situation? Believe in impossible, Sag. I see moon, blue moon here and I see moon here. Your emotions are creating some kind of illusion in your mind right now, Sash, that nothing is going to go right. Hermit shows me a negative vibe somehow, though it's not negative card because I see some soul searching is always needed before something big is going to happen in your life. But sometimes these thoughts build up a kind of negative emotion and that causes disappointment. So that might force you to think negatively that nothing is going to go right trust in the impossible trust in the divine and believe that something very positive is going to come out of this situation because i see behind this darkness there is a light waiting for you the sun shows me after the moon so i see that whatever illusions are there right now the lights are going to be there and you'll be out of the situation in no time i'm getting a very positive vibe up at the end especially when i see the outcome cards I see that if your heart is saying to hold back and not invest somewhere, don't do that because you don't know what next is coming towards you and it is definitely at the positive side, right? So be skeptical if you want. Oh my God, a new romantic cycle begins and I see that is probably something we were talking about with the locket card here. You might be getting a proposal from a distance overseas or maybe someone from a different country, different background. There is some distance between you both right now. We see some confession and love coming in, and this is going to lead to a very beautiful new romantic in your new romantic cycle in your life. So it's starting for you, Sagittarius. It's, it's happening for you. All you need to be just be careful of is that no, do not let the negative thoughts dominate on your mind. If you have dealt with some situation in past, right? So these are the messages I have for you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.